Good morning. Today we're spending the day at the Blood Ocean Outpost by Red Bull. And uh, this is a first map, again, believe it or not, outside community projects. Uh, so let's have a little explore around here. Let's regret that immediately. Okay, we're put right into the thick of it. Um, I, I want to avoid that revenant getting behind me. So I got a demon behind me instead. I'll do. Aha, okay. Well, I obligingly got hit in the face with a missile anyway. Oh my goodness, there's so much going on. All right, didn't go all that well. Let's see if we can do it again. Okay, so we're going to go for the double barrel shotgun immediately, I think. There we go. Well, this is, uh, <laughs> this is harder than I thought for a first released map outside the community project. That's often the way it goes now. Get up the stairs! Uh, was I being blocked there, or was it just my terrible manoeuvring? <laughs> you really, you really cannot afford to make a single mistake at the very start of this. As I miss everything with my super shotgun. Yeah, okay, there were bars over the door. So that was not my fault for being unable to retreat into a big gap. Okay, we're off the ground. Off the starting blocks at last, after having them uh, glued to our feet. Oh, that happened the first time that I uh, took Penny to one of those big indoor soft play centers. Uh, she was just a toddler and uh, she went for it forward out of my arms and then she froze at the entrance and I thought, oh, she must be nervous, is she, is she okay? And I went up to her and picked her up and she was velcroed to the floor. All right, 265 monsters to go. Here are two of them. Oh, that was a, a nice coincidence. Oh, wow. This is intense, Red Bull. All right, Arachnotron sighted. Let's just get rid of that from down here. What's going to happen as soon as I poke my head above here? <laughs> okay, fortunately they can't actually get me. We have the arrival of the chain gunners. Alright, I think uh, caution served me well there. I like the visuals in this map. There's nothing uh, too uh, overly complicated. Everything that's there works really well. Okay. Oh, that sounded like I was, uh, clipping there. Oh, well, I'll check on the video. Okay, then. You're definitely an ambush master. Somehow you find uh, places to put monsters so that uh, things look clear, but they ambush you as soon as you come into a room. All right, so overly generous rockets and oh dear. Uh, 
All right, as I so often say, give us a kicking. Let's try cleaning out one side and then backing away. Yeah, those uh, those barons are definitely. This is a good place to put a Baron, by the way. I, I often complain about Barons being replaceable with Hell Knights, but you really want, in this case, these uh, beef shields to uh, prevent you getting into that cupboard without a lot of work. I'm amazed uh, that went as well as it did, actually. I was uh, Usually I'd be dead by now. That's again! Again with the ambushes! All right, so I fell down here a bit prematurely. That is a lift, okay. Now, how can I get that? Hmm. I'll take it well. I'm, I'm able to jump, but I'm pretty sure that's not allowed. I'll just go around it then. Ah, that is a mercy pillar. No problem. Oh, my heat a revenant from down there. Still haven't opened that. Could do with a bit more scenery here. It's a bit of, of a flat square. But uh, as I've so often said, uh, outdoor scenery is very difficult to do in Doom. I was afraid of that. Okay. All right. Nobody else going to revive? Oh, I can get back to the start now. Is uh, no, I did check behind me. Okay. Uh, blue door over here, red door over there. Let's see what we can do with this one. Oh, that's a lot of caca demons. Chain gunners as well. Okay, the infighting started, that's very good news. There was another one. Okay then. Three teleports. Can't get up there yet. Alright, it looks like I need a blue key to get out. Is that right? Okay. That does not hurt me. Uh, this probably will. Ha <laughs> ha! A moment! <laughs> oh, there's no way! Right, now caca demons, get out the way. Whoop. 
Oh, where was he? Ching ching and up there. Ah. So, I, 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 after surviving the vast majority of that, just flinked to death by chain gunners. There we go. I don't know what's going right for me today, but uh, I've been fed the luck virus from Red Dwarf, I think. That was a massive encounter that I somehow survived just by dodging and weaving, and uh, and usually that takes me uh, several reloads. All right, we've got uh, we've got quite a lot of goodies in here actually. I'm still okay with my blue armor, somehow miraculously. No, we'll take that if uh, we ever need it. Oh. I was wondering if that was somehow enough to get up. I don't know what came over me. Okay then, so, uh, blue door. <laughs> I thought as soon as I pressed that, I thought I'm going to, I'm, I'm being primed to turn around here and the danger will be from there. All right, refreshing the armor. It'd be like a, there's a video going around on Twitter just now that's uh, it, it's a grenade-proof uh, air vent that curves around. So uh, in World War Two, if they threw a grenade into the bunker, it would just drop through and go back to you. <laughs> and people saying this is the most absurd Looney Tunes death ever. Imagining St. Peter at the gate saying, "Oh, wait a minute, let me get my phone out. You've got to see how you died." Um, all right, uh, I'm telling all, all this to uh, delay the inevitable here, because if I go this way, those barons are going to mince me. If I go this way, those imps are going to mince me, so there's not really much of a choice here. <laughs> um, let's see what happens. Sorry about you, your drums. Oh, the cacodemons as well. I do not know what's happening. Uh, pain elemental as well, that's not going to be good. Let's see. Oh, this cacodemons just in there. I think I might should be having, or some words in that order. Um, I might have to rocket the bounce first. Ow! Okay, let's let's try that. Well, that was about as healthy as jumping off a cliff. Let's try tearing through the imps first. I actually saved there because I was uh, I was proud of getting that far. Oh come on, they can't get the megasphere. Let's see. Not my greatest quick save. Oh yeah, I was kind of relying on the megasphere being there. <laughs> Straight into the claws. Yeah, let's uh, unquick save that. I think that's not a good place to be in. All right, so rock is on the revenant, and then clear out the imps and the dance.
I thought there was a door there. But that, that's good. That's that's the way to do it. Why are you dead yet? Oh! How embarrassing. I really like that mega sphere. I could just jump for it. But I feel that would be cheating, because it would be. The revenant's down, okay. I'm interested in this switch. I'd quite like to get there. Because it might contain some miracle that uh, removes all these monsters. It didn't, but uh, it's getting closer. Okay, that's good. That gives me a good vantage point. I mean, it removes the lack of vantage points. <laughs> Doesn't exactly give me a good one. Hang on. I had it, I had it there. There we go. Okay, we are back at full health. This would be a nightmare in vanilla because uh, you'd have all the uh, monsters blocking you from up in the air. Oh, I'm not doing as well this time. Okay. Wasn't a very clean victory, but we are still alive and that's what counts. Well, the, until that happens. Every single time I say something. Oh, I never took out this! Silly me. Still one more to go. There's something down there. Okay, here's the exit, or is it? It is not. Okay. Again, not my not my most clean victory. So how do I get that mega Oh. Oh they, oh it's just like that, is it? Okay, just round that little corner. Alright. 
Well, at least that means I'm finishing the level with perfect health. Couple of secrets I didn't discover. That plasma gun earlier in the level is going to taunt me. Now, yeah, I think this was really enjoyable. I think I think the only thing I would say to definitely uh, improve would be the outside scenery. Just a, a couple of little outposts around here, or just things that block your line of sight to the horizon would be fantastic. And this building outside's a bit square as well. You could uh, do something a bit more with that. Apart from that, uh, this was a really good, challenging map. Uh, it continued to surprise all the time, and an actually creative uh, climactic encounter, where it's mini slaughter and you have to make your own room and you don't just slap a cyber demon in. So thank you, Red Bull. Oh, we've got some custom uh, victory music as well. Oh, keep on making maps. That was really nice.